What's up ladies and gentlemen, Baker is the name and Tekken 7 is the game. This time we're going to go over Lars Alexanderson, launch punishable moves, jab punishable moves, things that we can flash and knock him down for. Let us begin. First off is forward 1 plus 4, the shoulder of doom. This move is negative 18 on block, you can launch it just about any way you want to. Up next is down forward 3 into 3. This is a double mid, but with the pushback, it's ne still negative 20, but the crouch dash 1 is the only one that works. Up next is down 1 plus 2, a knockdown low. Uh, you can punish this with a low block, get a wall rising 2 1 from. You have more than enough time to get this one off. And up next is down back 4. This is a low launcher on counter hit, and this is negative 26 on block. Up next is up 4 3, a super, super huge launcher. This is negative 26 on block. However, if you punish this move too fast, you will float him in the air. Also, no sword stance also works on block. This is forward, forward, four into three. Uh, this is a two hit string. The low and the mid itself is launch punishable on. Up next is forward, forward, three plus four. These are a set of lows that are low punishable on block, depending on the range. But if you still do block it, you can launch this. This is forward back to one. A double hit set or a double set of mids. It's negative 18 up. Last but not least is a supercharge in the two. This is a move unique only to Lars, but even then this move is launch punchable and well seen. Hmm. Up first in the jab punishable section, I have 1-1-1 one, 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 and 1-4. One, both of these moves ended high and low respectively, but they're both negative 12 on block as well. So you can only get a down 4-4 four, four or a wall rising 4. And up next I have 2-1-3 and 2-1-4. Got a 50-50 for you. The first mid ending is negative 12 on block, but you can flash in the middle of it. And the second one ends in a high, requiring you to duck. If you guess right, these are your options. Up next, we have four, two, into four. Despite this move being two highs and you being able to duck it, this move is still negative 12 on block. You can get it down for a four one. Up next, I have a down back 1 into 3. You can also cancel this into down to go into wall rising. This move is really, really tricky for me because this is a low high, but the recovery on this move is the same. Ducking, ducking low will be negative 12 on block. I tried to flash it. I mean, low pairing works if you read, of course, but this one gave me a bit of trouble. Up next is down back 1 plus 2, a back swing mid. It's not much to it, it's just negative 12 on block. Up next is forward forward 2. This is actually a launcher for Lars. Unfortunately, we can't launch this. It is only negative 12 on block. Up next is wall rising 1, pretty much the same as forward forward 2. This is a launching mid that he has, but it's only negative 12 on block as well. And this move is wall standing 2-1, not to be confused with wall standing 1. Can't do much about this, it puts it in full crouch and is also negative 2. And last but not least, we have full crouch down forward 1 plus 2. These are a double set of lows that he can do from various stances while he's crouched. These two are negative 12, and you can only get a wall rising 4 from it. And coming up as our ender here, we have Lars' 10 hit combo. You are going to want to low parry the 5th hit out of this. Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to thank you guys for watching this video. Please leave a like on it if you liked it or don't if you did not. Please subscribe to my channel if you're new. And Monster Hunter World comes out tomorrow. I'm sorry, Tekken content is going to have to slow down for a bit while Monster Hunter World takes over my life. I'm going to try. I'm, I'm seriously going to try to tr make a Tekken video every now and again, or at least another guide video, but it's going to be hard for the first couple of days. I do appreciate you guys watching nonetheless, and I will see you guys later. Fuck a stage, I'm sick of people and that's sad at my age. I'm 22 and seen more than I could actually say. Dream job, can't wait until I get to do it. A workaholic, the results got me addicted to it. If that's
that's a devil, I don't listen to him If that's a God, I ain't pitching to him Cause he know what I don't mention to him What's the point in praying to him? What would I be saying to him other than complaining to him? Despite his indifference, I'm afraid to lose him Just looking at me, you can tell that I'm a bad acquaintance Shit, I got more L's than a Spanish language